That included an FA Trophy away win at Chelmsford, beating Halifax 2-0. And, of course, that 3-3 draw midweek against Oldershot. And we're underway. And early on, Wilstone looking to get the ball forward. Or was that a bit of a hand? Referee says no. Here's Cook this season. 58 goals so far coming into this one for Barnett. And it's coming in straight away. Oh, what an incredible save there by Marcus Dewhurst. 12th at the start of play in the Vanarama National League. Finished 13th last season, did Wildstone. It's been a wave form that's really cost the Stones an assault on the playoffs. Just two wins and two draws. Could that change today? He loads up, has a strike as well. High and over. Hartlepool United nil. Chesterfield top the table. Bromley second, Barnet third. Oh, lovely little bit of skill by Taran Alarakia. We've come to expect that from him. The shot comes in. It's straight into the arms, though, of Josh Keeley. Pritchard had just trotted into an offside position, so that was taken away. It's up. It's over the bar. And Hartigan to Reese Hall Johnson. Space on this right hand side. The ball's coming in. Dewhurst is tracking back, but he's only gone as far as Ben Coker. He's got Zach Brunt in acres of space. Oh, and somehow he's made his way in. And it is that man. It's Callum Stead with it. Well, it looked like there was a little bit of confusion in the box for the Wheelstone defence. First, it was Ben Coker in acres of space. Zach Brunt had space, but it found its way through to Callum Stead, who pokes it home. And it's Barnett at one, Wheelstone nil. In comes the corner. Hartigan takes it. Oh, it's just headed over. Half an hour played here. The ball's whipped in and all oh, and it's made its way through and with his sixth of the season oh beautifully taken down by Maguire Drew and it's caught Dewhurst completely off his line and it's headed away off the line by Jack Cook oh my word and another golden opportunity for Barnett might at one point have been earmarked for Wildstone but as it is it's Barnett's home ground and Callum Stead gets in oh he's just dinked it over the bar is this the season that Barnett get themselves back promoted? Here's Reese Hall Johnson. Maguire drew. Beautiful ball back to Reese Hall Johnson. It's whipped across, and it was Dewhurst who got a good hand to it. Going around in circles, Sambo, and trying to take as many Barnett players with him as possible, and did a really, really good job there. Here's Brandon Mason. Can he get it forward? Here's Adarqua into the box. Nine goals this season for him. Bowen knocks it back in. Oh, and it was an acrobatic attempted overhead kick there, which came to nothing. Oh, it's a good strike from Seaman. Keeley will down quick to his left-hand side. Grown into this, and they're capable. Corey Andrews has come on the forward. In it comes. Oh, and it's just headed over. Cropper with the ball in. Oh, it's headed away. It's Zach Brunt, oh, just right up, right off the post, oh my word. Hartigan, he's got space, no one's closing him down at all, how far can he go? Was there a push? Yes, there was, penalty. Here we go, Pritchard v Dewhurst. Penalty, Pritchard, saved, Dewhurst saves it, remarkable. Keeley takes it again, he has to drop it, second time in the game, he's had to take very quick evasive action. And now we're through, could this be the moment? It's Callum Stead, lovely little bit of skill, wonderful save by Marcus Dewhurst. Here's Mundell Smith, trying to find Corey Andrews. Be careful, no, push it, Andrews! Corey Andrews equalises in the last minute of the game! And the hive absolutely erupts!